speaking to Janice and her team at, at uh, HIFU in Toronto, is they send you all the paperwork and they get your information from the urologist. And it's probably a good 10 days to two weeks of them kind of sorting through that and, and looking at schedules and, and you figuring out when it's good and, and, and for, for both parties. And then basically determining that you're a great candidate for HIFU, which most of us are. Um, so having to arrange travel schedules, and, and it really was only for me about a three and a half to four week period from the time I first spoke to Janice to when I got on a plane and went to Toronto. So think about this. I got on a plane on a Tuesday after Tuesday. I landed in Toronto, went to the clinic, had an hour meeting at five o'clock. They kind of walked me through the procedure. Uh, they put you up at a great hotel about 20 minutes away from the clinic. And um, went in, had a little dinner, not much, showed up at 10 o'clock the next morning. They prepped me. I believe they probably knocked me out at 11 o'clock. And when you can prove that you can walk out of there, uh, which was 6 o'clock in the afternoon, the cab was waiting. I got back in. I went back to the hotel. Some discomfort from the catheter because I'd never had one before. Had dinner, went to sleep, um, woke up the next morning actually feeling great and went back into the clinic at 10 o'clock and they said, how do you feel? And I said, other than this catheter, I feel great. And they said, see you later. So I'm on a plane, picked up at Seattle at five o'clock in the afternoon, home and, and quite frankly, back to normal.